So for the right, when you're playing the back side screen, I'm noticing a lot of my players take the racket too far back. And now they're running forward, the racket's back. They're getting power, but they can't control the ball and keep it in the court. As they're moving in, the court's becoming shorter. I want them to focus more on moving forward to get the back side with the racket ready. And now I have an option to drive, shift low at their feet, or lob. More options for the shorter backswing. So when you're doing the back side, I like to keep my battle out in front so then I can defend it. Now, instead of having the racket going back, then I could only drive. I'll show you one of those where the racket goes back early. Now I'm going to get it and I can only drive and it gets out of control. And they know I'm driving. When I move forward here with the racket in front options, I keep them guessing. So again, short backswing. Get that side screen hard. There we go. And I could chip and follow it in. I could, that's one of the moves. I could lob. So I'm usually thinking here, and I could also, as I'm doing it, I can kind of look at the ball and know what they're doing. If they go off the net, there we go. And by do a nice chip at their feet. So my options again, with good preparation options. Chip and charge when they're off the net. Chip and lob. Chip at them. I have three options. When my racket goes back, it's one. Drive and hope they don't hit it. I mean, hope they I hit them. Because normally it's going to be too big to keep it in. One of my options is my chip and then charge. That's my first option. Another option would be just chip at them and stay. So this one, I'm just gonna chip it at them to test their volleys. You see it? Because with the same preparation, they don't know if I'm gonna chip and charge, chip and pro, or I can also lob now and push them back. Time's up. Thank you so much for watching the video. And please do me a favor and subscribe and ring the bell. And my promise to you before I go is if you watch all these one minute clinics, you too can become a national champion. Well, maybe. So here's the bat. Uh, hey, you see, and then they look like they're flailing and falling because there's too much going on.